So you've installed Star's Battlefront 2, gone it free from Epic Games, the Celebration Edition. You get Frosty Mod Manager, get the mods ready, do everything you says in the, in the tutorial, press launch. And then you go and check the mods. It hasn't worked. Everything's the same, you relaunch it, same thing. So yeah, today I'm going to show you um, a fix. I want to say quickly that some people have said that it works, others said it doesn't. Um, I didn't get it to work, but that's because I did something wrong in it, so I'm going to try and help you. If you have any problems with it, then I'm try and help you in the comment section. So yeah, let's get on to the fix. So what you want to do is, um, to fix this, you want to make sure you got Origin open. Go into, um, Game Properties. Now go to Advanced Launch Options. Now you need to do Dash Data Path. Put Space, and you need to have, um... These, make sure you put these symbols, and in between here, you need to write the, go into your Styles Battlefront 2 folder. Go here, if you've already, um, launched the, uh, the mod, I've tried to do it before, it'll come up with this mod data. So just go into here, and make sure you copy, make sure copy this, um, directory for you. Um, I will leave the default one in the description if you don't change the install location, but if you change the install location, then you've got to, um, uh, copy it from here. But it might be different depending, it might be pro program files times 86, but it'll be different for everyone. So you just copy it from here. So you just go and press this arrow, and then you just copy it here, Control c Control v into here. So this is what it will probably be like, if you haven't changed it, it'll be D Games program, program Files, Origin Games, Battlefront 2, Styles Battlefront 2, Mod Data. That's what it'll be for some. For me it's different because um, I changed it. So yeah, and then after that you'll want to quick click save. Now what you want to do is make sure you restart this Frosty Mod Manager. And also you want to re-remove this. And and then just add it back in with the Styles Battlefront 2.exe. And then yeah. Now go select again. And then all the mods should reappear in here, I think. So now what you want to do is um, add your mod in. So I'm just going to do that one again. And then you should press launch and it should work. Now you've gone in. And it's worked. Now I want to make tell you a couple other things. also want to quickly say sorry for the terrible graphics. It's, if you've seen my other videos, I've got a very bad PC. But yeah, that's it. That's the mod. Gosh, I'm going to get this one. So I want to talk about things. If it didn't work, uh, there's a couple other suggestions. Make sure you've saved it. And also, um, make sure that you've, um, re you've got to make sure you remove the old Battlefront that you did, and then just redo it. So, when you set up the first step, once you first load up the Frosty Mod Manager, uh, you got to, you know how it says, um, Styles Battlefront 2, you have to set up, create new, and then choose the Battlefront 2.exe. Make sure remove the old one you did, and redo that. If that didn't work, make sure you didn't do, you didn't, you did that. Um, also want to say that, um, Make sure you did actually spell everything correctly in the um in the, in the mod in the in the startup thing. So if you guys like, comment, like, and subscribe. I hope and have fun modding Styles Battlefront 2. Bye.